Hey there, friends and followers. In today's quick video segment, we are going to give you guys a heads up and a sneak peek behind the top five attractions here in the Ocala Marion County area. Stick around for the next couple of minutes to find out what they are and to catch a glimpse of them. Yes, indeed. Welcome back. As always, thanks for tuning in, checking out the videos. So the top five attractions here in the Ocala Marion County area. Now you may recall a few of these from another video I did, which was the top 10 things to do here in Ocala. And if you didn't catch that video, no worries. I'll actually include a link at the uh, top of the screen there. Nonetheless, top five attractions. Let's check them out. Coming in at the number five spot is Big Daddy Don Garlitz Museum of Drag Racing. Now, uh, this attraction is located just off Interstate 75 and Highway 484, which makes it super easy and convenient to locate. Originally opening in 1984, this location will uh, walk you through the history of the sport of drag racing. It's said to have about 90 some different race cars in the uh, race car showroom, as well as an additional 50 vehicles in the uh, antique car showroom as well. Not only can you check out uh, Garlet's Swamp Rat vehicles, which are on display, but you can also check out other types of memorabilia from top names in the sport. Coming in at the number four spot is Wayne's World of Paintball. Now this attraction is considered one of Central Florida's finest paintball facilities. Facilities. Located off of Highway 441, which runs smack dab through Ocala, this location gives amateurs and veterans the opportunity alike to engage in uh, speedball, regular paintball, and airsoft battle tournaments. They are also world renowned for their 24 hour role playing scenario games, which takes uh, place at the attraction on an annual basis. Coming in at number three is the Canyon Zipline and Adventure Park. Now this great attraction gives visitors five different options to choose from as far as their zipline adventure goes and spans across uh, various different canyon areas as well as four different lakes. In addition to that they also have a full moon zipline adventure which takes place in the evening hours for added excitement as well. If that wasn't enough they also provide uh, horseback riding tours Taste of History Tours, which provides uh, visitors with locally made wines and chocolates, kayak tours, and even a gem mining experience. Definitely an attraction you're not going to want to miss. Coming in at the number two spot is the World Equestrian Center. Now, as you may or may not know, Ocala is actually considered the horse capital of the world. So the idea to bring this attraction here to the area was a no-brainer. Situated off of Northwest 80th Street in the middle of horse country, this is the largest equine complex here in North America and is only uh, one of two locations uh, here in the country as well. Through their core values of quality, class, and distinction, this attraction provides uh, visitors with a one-of-a-kind experience no matter where you fall into the equine uh, industry, be it visitor, spectator, sponsor, or retailer. Coming in at the number one spot for top attractions here in the area is none other than the Silver Springs State Park. Now, Silver Springs is located uh, just east of Ocala off of State Road 40, just before hitting the Ocala National Forest. Being labeled as one of Florida's first tourist attractions, uh, this location was established before the Civil War around the 1852 timeframe. It gained massive popularity throughout the early to mid 1900s for its usage in television and film and uh, was uh, solidified as a uh, top tourist attraction by implementing the world famous glass bottom boats, which gave visitors a first hand view of the uh, Silver Springs themselves, as well as the other beautiful naturally occurring Florida settings. In later years, it went on to become a small scale amusement park, incorporating all kinds of different uh, various types of uh, attraction rides, animal exhibitions and educational resources and even was the location for the Wild Waters Water Park, uh, which ran from about 1978 to 2016. In recent years, after being picked up by the state, a lot of the activities are discontinued, but upon getting into the park, uh, you can still pay a small fee to check out the uh, world-famous glass bottom boats. Well, there you have it, my friends. Those are the top five attractions for here in the Ocala Marion County area. Uh, be sure to like the video and comment below if you've ever been to one of these attractions or uh, would like any further information pertaining to any of the ones mentioned. As always, thanks for tuning in, checking out the videos. We'll catch you guys on the next one.